Hey everybody, welcome back to Half the Battle. We got another gear review here. And today it's going to be for the Countycom Maritac 26650 flashlight. This guy right here. Um, brand new flashlight. I uh, just got notice of it last week sometime. I ordered it immediately uh, to get it here to do a review for you guys. And uh, it looks like it's going to be a pretty good one. Uh, comes with this uh, cool little county comm sticker. Um, if you're not familiar with them, they do a lot of government contracts and a lot of work for the government and make a lot of uh, military surplus, mill surp type things. Um, great company. I have quite a few of their products and I've never had a problem with them. Uh, came with this here too. And I'm not sure if this is valid for everybody or just me, but it says the code is offered valid for 30 days. So 10% off uh, if you guys want to make an order there. There's uh, there's, there's that free code. Let's, uh, let's get into her, though. I've been waiting to check this out. Okay. Comes with this little uh, reflector-type dot that you can put on the back here. Um, interesting. Let's get everything out. All right. Okay. So... Comes with a bag of washers, uh, not washers, um, O rings, rubber O rings, and another little door. So, this light actually has charging built into it. So, you don't need a separate charger for the battery. Um, if you do have a hobby type charger or e sig type charger or anything like that, you can probably charge this battery in that. But if you don't have one of those, the light will charge right here on the side without any needed extra stuff. Just a uh, mini USB, which it, it comes with, or micro USB, I believe it is, that it comes with right here. And you can charge the battery in here. Um, there's a charging indicator, if I remember right, on the button. I haven't actually charged it yet. I just pulled it out today. So, not sure about the charge indicator. I will uh, check that out later and see. Uh, comes with this here, which I believe is a baggie with a little lanyard in it. Um, lanyard you can connect yeah it's got a little o-ring or not o-ring a uh, little split ring jump ring type thing and oh yep there's a hole there so there's a lanyard a wrist lanyard you can connect to it if uh you're afraid of dropping it or you just need the extra lanyard whatever i mean to each their own whoever needs a lanyard it comes with one um now i believe the specs on this guy are it's maximum is uh i believe 2020 Lumens is what they claim, um, and it's got a four setting switch, low, medium, high, and turbo, um, and it says charging here, you plug it into the port, and adapter this, uh, okay, so you need at least a one amp, five volt charging cube, which I think everybody has one if they have a cell phone. Um, the light on the cap will change from green to off when complete. So yeah, I believe when they're talking about that, they're talking about this cap here. Uh, it will change from green and it'll turn off when it's done charging. Uh, let me get, put this off to the side here. Let's take a look at her. Uh, I know from seeing it on their website that when we get the battery, it comes with this little yellow protector on it to keep it from uh, draining. So we'll go ahead and take that off. And it's actually in the wrong polarity. now. I'm pretty sure they wouldn't, this won't harm it. Uh, <laughs> we'll see here. But yeah, so you can't, you can't turn it on if the battery's in the wrong polarity, which is, you know, that's a nice thing. And it does come with this battery. Um, so you're not going to have to go out and search for a separate battery. It's going to go ahead and come with this high capacity battery here. And I mean, a lot of the e-cigs nowadays, a lot of people are using them. They're using the size battery. So you may have these sitting around if you're into that whole thing. Um, if not, it, like I said, it comes with one. You can, they, they sell them separate on the site. Uh, it's, it's got some weight to it, and this is actually, I believe it, they say it's an IPX68 rating, so it is, it is fully waterproof. Um, it's got, it's got this, uh, coating on the lens here, and I'm not sure if that lens is, uh, yeah, I think it is. It's got a little bit of a tint to it, so I'm pretty sure that's an anti-glare lens. It's got this nice, uh, red aircraft grade aluminum ring here and uh, like i said it's a four mode operation so it's going to start it's going to start on low medium high and then you got your turbo which is the full 2020 and that is blinding and to turn it off you just hold this down for two seconds uh, it does not have a lock but one of the things they say to do is just to unscrew this a couple turns and then you can't turn it on so, in lieu of a lock, you just unscrew this. If you're going to throw it in your pack, your pocket, you don't want it accidentally turning on, just unscrew this a couple turns and you're good. 
Uh, it does have a memory, so it will go back to whatever the last setting was. Like say that's the low setting. Let's, say, let's put it into say high and turn it off. Now it's going to go back to that high setting automatically. So we'll take it outside and we'll get some beam shots of it outside to see uh, just how far and how bright it goes. And other than that, yeah, it's it's a decent little light. Uh, it's got some weight to it. It seems pretty durable. I've never had any problems with anything from this company. So I am definitely looking forward to carrying this one and checking it out in the long term. But uh, for now, let's head outside and get some beam shots. As you can see, it's got a pretty impressive throw on it. Uh, I believe it is a, yeah, it's a non-domed LED and that always increases the throw rate, the throw, throw length, I'm sorry, not rate. Uh, definitely always increases that. So yeah, it's it's a good light. Uh, definitely recommend it. I definitely recommend checking it out. It's the brand new one. I believe they did a run of only 500. So if you're interested, the link will be down here in the description to check it out. So yeah, thanks for uh, watching my video. Uh, please like, comment, subscribe, do all that good stuff, and uh, look forward to seeing you next time.